local nonprofit now helping keep a spark in kids' lives when it comes to their creativity. Friends of the Children created the Spark Squad during the pandemic. That's an after school style club online that pairs up kids with mentors. In positive vibes tonight, Jenny Hansen shows us how it'll stick around in some form even after the pandemic ends. So we're walking around. Here's our banana. This is our banana RPG. And you need to make it to the maze and figure out what's inside the door, that red door over there. And figure out how to get the banana from one side of the board to come out the other. 11-year-old Zaid is part of this Spark Squad coding club led by mentors from the wacky world of coding. It's fun to be with other people who want that. And a lot of them mm -hmm. also play video games. So we play a bit of games before we do some coding, which is fun. And it's just a good time and we learn some stuff each time. Nonprofit Friends of the Children pairs mentors with underserved kids, typically working with them from kindergarten all the way through high school. The Spark Squad was created as a result of the pandemic, teaching skills from coding to baking to braiding hair. And we wanted to create a virtual space twice a week for 90 minutes. That was not school. It was definitely a space that centered around the youth that were walking alongside, centered around their interests, centered, centered around their sparks. Zaid has been part of the Friends of the Children family, but the Spark Squad has been an extra bonus and truly helped him find his spark. Yesterday, I did my coding club and I learned how to fix two different bugs. Literally within the first like week, I was like, oh no, this is the best thing that's happened to him all week. He's mm -hmm. yeah, the only way we could connect. The Spark Squad caught the attention of Pacific Power's Pacific Corp Foundation, which recently awarded the Friends of the Children a grant. Look for local nonprofits um, that are engaged in programming like this that helps the community get through these difficult times mm -hmm. and to support those efforts. These efforts have been so successful, Tracy Ross says they will permanently incorporate elements of the Spark Squad. I also hope that Zaid can come to my office and help me with a few bugs that are on my computer once we get back to, to virtual. I need your help, Zaid. <laughs> The Pacific Power Foundation awards grant money throughout the year, and the next deadline to apply is June 15th. We've got a link for that at coin.com.